All right, paint protection film is done. The next thing we gotta do is apply some G-Technic Crystal Serum Light. We're gonna do one coat of this and two coats of G-Technic XO V4. All right, so passenger side is done. Now hear me out. I was originally just gonna make this a quick, straight to the point five minute video, but things took a turn for the worse. As you can see, everything looks good from here, but it took me about, I don't know, two hours opening and closing the hood, trying to make everything fit right. And I'll show you guys that in just a minute. I still got the other side to do, but man, this is such a pain. It only took about, what, 20 minutes to get the old fender off and the new fender back on. Still got the carbon one right here. I already took this part off. Uh, but in, in the meantime, let me get this done and let's just have a little chat about these fenders. Okay, so looks like the fitment on this side is a little bit better than the other side. As you can see, the gap right here is a lot better. And this side is good. And I added a spacer right here. I don't know if you guys can see that. Just to lift it up a little bit more, just to get rid of this little gap that's here. But I don't know if that's gonna work. We will see once I close the hood and show you guys how this fits with this little spacer. So you're probably asking, should I get these ones that are a little bit cheaper or should I get the authentic ones, which are not that much more over these replica ones? The only advantage I see with these ones is these come pre-painted and the paint match on this is pretty damn good. M4 is just looking so good out there, but there will be mods or changes coming to the M4 coming soon. All right, cold start for the boys. Oh, that's such a cliche thing to say, isn't it? Yeah. I don't even know what that is. We just had a local car meet they do that I just found out they do this every week. McLaren, one day guys, one day. The 86 here. The car looks like it's fun as hell to drive, too. Oh, shit. My leg can come out, too. <laughs> oh, man. Hey, too hot for TV, man. <laughs>
sun went down quick. I swear I've only been out here for like five minutes. But anyways, check this out. Oh, let me adjust the camera real quick. All right, fenders are fully installed. I'm telling you guys, I really like the look of the paint match fenders so much better than the carbon fiber ones. I always felt that the carbon fiber fenders was just, you know, it just didn't look right to me. It, it felt like that was the focal point of the side view of the car, which it really shouldn't be. But still a few more adjustments to do on the fenders to make it fit a little bit better. I just ran out of time. I'll probably do that off camera sometimes. But overall, really like the way it looks. Just looks overall much cleaner. But if any of you guys are local and want my old carbon fiber fenders, please let me know. DM me, whatever. Anyways, that is it. Thanks for watching. I appreciate you guys supporting the channel. More stuff to come for the Super and the M4. That's right. Mods coming for the M4. And we will talk to you guys later. Peace out, guys.